Hey guys, it's Holly from Charm and Gumption, and today I'm going to talk about product photography. If you're just recently opening a shop, chances are you're trying to keep costs low and you may not want to invest in an HD camera like a DSLR or something like that. So today I'm going to show you the basics when it comes to product photography and how you can get great photos for your online shop using just your iPhone. Okay, so the first and most important thing that you have to consider is lighting. You want to have indirect light, which means that there is light outside next to where you're shooting, but not shining directly onto your surface, which causes light spots and shadows. Let's start by shooting a flat item. I'm going to be shooting a little card from my shop. What I like to do is just lay down a large white sheet of paper. If you're shooting something white, you might want to use a darker color so that it's more noticeable, but it depends on the color of your item. When you're shooting something flat like this, you just want to simply take a picture from directly overhead with no angle, and that'll just give you a very basic shot. And then you want to also take an angled picture so that you can show off the detail. Okay, so that was pretty easy. Let's move on to shooting a three-dimensional item. What I do is I take the same sheet of paper and I just curve it up against the wall and tape it so that it doesn't slip. And this bended paper keeps all of the focus on the item you're shooting because it's blank and there aren't any sharp lines in the background like there would be if you were shooting on the edge of a table or something. Um, and then I just place the item in the center and again you want to make sure that you have that indirect light coming from the side. Especially with three-dimensional items, you want to make sure that you shoot the item from all angles and also include little detail shots. Make sure that the product is in focus by clicking on your screen until you see a yellow square. Once I'm done shooting, I like to upload the pictures to my computer and then I use Photoshop, but you can use any photo editor, and you just want to increase the brightness slightly and it makes a big difference, it makes your image really pop. I hope this video was helpful for you guys. This is just a very basic way to get professional, simple photos for your online shop. Um, be sure to subscribe for more videos and check out my online shop and blog at charmandgumption.com.